Yes, you lot, what you're saying, in today's video we're going to be designing merch for an upcoming artist named David Kushner. Personally, I would describe Kushner's music as a breath refresher within today's poppy saturated market. David's calming voice paired with his cinematic wilderness showcase in his music videos really creates a deep picture of the narratives conveyed within his songs. The versatility of Kushner's voice really portrays him within a unique spotlight, such as the angelic and almost esoteric harmonies in his song Elk Grove. And guys, I'm not kidding, this song sounds as if it's a soundtrack for when you're walking through the gates of heaven. It's actually insane. So after you've watched this video, definitely go check out his music, links will be in the description below. Now within design, I've always really appreciated graphics which have that sort of wilderness tone to them. Whether it's with van life inspired fonts, vintage camping patches, or overall just adventure narrative posters. As Krishna's music really revolves around being in the wilderness and the outdoors, designing some merch with artists is something I couldn't wait to do. And spoiler alert, I'm very happy with how these t-shirts came out. Starting off my merch designs with David Kushner, I decided to create a graphic for Elk Grove, which was one of my favourite songs. My goal for this t-shirt was to design something which felt calming and soft, reflecting the mood within this music. The narratives within this song speak upon themes of grieving and heartbreak. I wanted to steer away from the obvious imagery for this and instead convey how the path may look for someone going on a walk to cope with these emotions. Primarily set in America, as Kushner's brand really seems to reflect the American wilderness as opposed to which I have in the UK. I included subtle hints of sadness and grief by including this image of a rain poured puddle. I thought this worked really nicely as it reflects the outdoor journey my initial idea was to convey, and also the emotion within his song. In hindsight, I may have used too much imagery of Elk to complement the song title, however, I think this does a nice job of appealing as an aesthetic graphic to those who are unfamiliar with Kushner's music. Finishing the design off, I incorporated these star vector PNGs as I thought it left a quite whimsical and angelic touch to the design. My second design approach was in the complete opposite direction to the first one. Instead of creating something soft and calming, I wanted to create a huge, almost movie-like statement graphic. Within Kushner's song Burn, the chorus revolves around the lyrics of You Watched Me Burn. These lyrics to me really paint a vivid picture. And although someone being on fire is maybe the obvious go-to imagery for these lyrics, I really wanted to design that hard-hitting graphic. I ultimately set David on fire. <laughs> Sorry mate. I decided to erase Kushner's face and replace it with burnt charcoal as I wanted to work with more of a silhouette of his figure. To help create this, I placed David's glasses falling off his wrist, still visible to the eye. This was because I think the glasses is very prominent within his brand and look, as seen in all his most recent music videos. Now I can't help but feel like this would make a really cool album cover, so I'll have to mock this up later in the video for you guys to let me know what you think. And for my final design, I wanted to create a graphic around the lyrics of his song in Daylight, which read, You and I drink the poison from the same vine. I really wanted to create an environment for this t-shirt, playing with various dark botanicals and an overgrown, almost abandoned setting, which ultimately included poisonous plants. Again, I wanted to stay away from the most obvious imagery within this design, which would probably be a cliché bottle of poison with a label. Although it did include a vial of poison within this graphic, I believe it was done in a more subtle way up for interpretation. I 
I stayed to this dark green colorway throughout as the previous designs were also dark, creating a synergy of all three graphics which will be showcased in just a minute. So, here's the final three designs for my take on unofficial merch for David Kushner. I believe I achieved what I set out to do by combining Wilderness and Kushner's lyrics and brand to create three separate designs which look as if they belong in all the same merchandise drop. As for that burnt album cover I said I'd mock up, here it is. Let me know what you guys think, and if it's something you'd like to have in your vinyl collection, or maybe you'd want to design it differently. Let me know in the comments below which is your favourite design. So there you guys have it, thank you so much for watching and I really hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I did designing these graphics. If you're a previous viewer, you may have noticed my approach to this video was slightly different to usual. This was because I wanted to create a more sort of cinematic and story based video really describing the ideas behind the designs as opposed to the technical process. So let me know if you prefer this sort of style of editing for the future videos. And if you guys enjoyed this video, you may want to check out my other merch designs, cheeky little plug, again link will be in the description, I recommend watching my Ren video. If you guys haven't already, please feel free to head over to my socials, links are in the description. If you guys enjoyed this merch design, then I highly recommend you go check out my other video designing merch from Ren, which will be just here. And uh, yeah, until next time guys, I'll see you in the next one in a bit.